Good morning. It's a new day. Today I'm going to speak about a word called Amani. I read this somewhere and I liked it. I thought I should share it with you. Uh, Amani is a Swahili word. It means peace. And it, it is also many years back, uh, there, there, was a, there was some zoologist who, who named a Labrador puppy a puppy, a Labrador, he, and named this particular Labrador uh, uh, Amani, you know, and uh, and they and they started uh, taking care of of this dog Amani, and uh, his name itself meant peace. Uh, one of the reason was that a zoologist uh, felt that this particular Labrador called Swahili or peace, in Swahili it's called a peace, Amani, and they used to call him Amani. So they found out that this particular Amani, which is a Labrador dog, had a calming and soothing effect and brings in a relaxation for other animals. So what happened? They put the Labrador in a group of two young cheetahs not grown up, young cheetahs, babies, and they found out that Amani was creating a positive and a calming influence in those cheetahs, young cheetahs' life. And instead of them getting a bit aggressive, they realized that because of the, uh, because of the company of Amani, which is the Labrador puppy, the young cheetahs began to fee be a little more relaxed and calming. Uh, why am I telling you this today? I want to tell you that, uh, you know, there is someone else who is more powerful and can give you a permanent soothing effect and which the Bible calls that person God. I want to tell you today, there was, in, there's a story that says that the king called David and he used to be called to play the uh, to play the harp in front of king saul so when the time when he was playing the harp uh, in front of king saul at that time david was a shepherd and they came to know that when david plays the harp what happens is is a soothing effect on people and Saul, King Saul, was very depressed. He was not getting sleep. He was very, very depressed. For some reason, the restless spirit was in him. And someone told him, why don't you call David? He plays the harp. When he plays, you will feel much better. And David was called. And David played. And whenever David played, uh, it, it caused a soothing and a calming effect on King Saul's life. He could sleep well. He could... The, he was no longer feeling so restless. Whenever the music was played, he felt so much soothing. I want to encourage you today that soothing effect and that calming is something that the Lord gives us and that is the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit brings peace in our life. You know, the, uh, the Bible says, the, Jesus says, the peace I give you, the world cannot give you. When you have the Spirit of God in your life, there is a soothing effect. When you realize that you cannot do anything by yourself, you need the Holy Spirit. That will bring in peace. That will bring in uh, Amani, Swahili, in Swahili language called Amani. That will bring in the peace that you want in your life. Rest, good sleep in the night. No restlessness, no anxiousness. And the only person that can do that is the Holy Spirit that can cause that permanent uh, calmness in your spirit. May the Lord bless you with his peace. Mm -hmm.